Hey everybody, I'm sorry you glad, just call me Glant, and welcome back to more Star Ocean Integrity and Faithlessness. Last time, Fidel's dad died, and we beat a super hard boss that already killed me once, and made our way back to Medoc. Now we got the other half of the trip to get out of the way. The half of the trip that goes from Medoc to Santorol. And we gotta go to Santorol and do all this fun stuff. Hey, this is where I can buy all the old stuff I didn't buy before. No, I didn't want to equip him. I didn't pay attention when I push. Just holding on to them just in case they become useful later. I mean, I have the money to buy them now. Okay. Anything else is zero? You're zero. Okay, let's fix Fidel's equipment now. There we go. What's in here? I never actually looked in here. Go away. Wait, is this Welch's house? Is this Welch's house? This is Welch's house. Here, try this delicious juice recipe I've concocted. Don't be shy. It's got the Welch seal of approval, which is the best in the business. See the label? Go on now. Down the hatch with it. Crazy lady named Welch. Um... It was downright ambrosial when I made it with fruit. Maybe there's a problem in the recipe? That has to be it. Hey, you there. You with all the frills. Congratulations! You're my second assistant. As your first duty, you can improve this juice recipe. You've undertaken the following crest. Drunk on creation. Hmm. What did I need to deliver? Lemon and a bottle of spring water. Oh, I have plenty of those. Hey. Just enough cooks, fishing, and alluring pastime, and lemon juice. Eh. Worth talking about. What's this, assistant number two? Your improved recipe? And you even brought me the ingredients? I knew I could count on you. Let me mix it right up. Does this mean I get to cook? She's Tony the Tiger now. I knew I was right to entrust the homebody with a homey task, but don't think it's because I can't do stuff like that. No siree. Here, assistant number one. I made another go at this whole juice thing. You'll love it this time, I guarantee. Ah, well, let me do it. <laughs> Break the immersion. Punch in the face by flavor once again. What? How can that be? Oh, sorry. That was a little something left over from an earlier experiment. You have unlocked the cooking specialty. You have unlocked the fishing specialty. I've unlocked them, but I have to buy them. Cook ingredients to create items. The numbers you can increase, increase the level. 
Yeah, uh, yeah, there's fish for catch fish for catches at fishing poles. So it's cooking in here. Yes, it is. Can I make gold omelet? What is the do? Ooh, attack plus 10% for three battles and recovers five HP to everybody. What does this one need? A lemon and a raw fish? Grilled fish. Tomato, fresh veggies, and spring water. Mine's drone. Yeah, it's just mentality. Vegetable stir fry. MP cost minus 10% for three battles. Ooh! What else can I make? I make that one. Is it required? Lemon, spring water, and nectar. It's done. Make some lemon juice! Which is 20 HP all and 20 MP all. I might have to make a lot of those. It's done. If I can make more. I can't make any more lemon juice. Why? Did I run out of lemon? No, I ran out of spring waters. I buy some more. So are those unusable items? That thing from the game or somewhere else? I keep hearing a ding. Hmm. Oh, so is this something I have to drink in the menu? Just like a menu-only item. Looks like it. Ah, well that would have been useful if it was more than just a menu-only item. Well, now that we've spent like seven minutes with the crazy lady named Welsh, we're going to move on and head towards Santoral. Because we learned to cook. That's all we needed, right? Everything you need in life, learn to cook. And fish. I don't know where I'm supposed to go fishing at. It just said at fishing holes. I have no idea what that is. And hey, look. Right up by Santoral, that little... Portal to the castle or cathedral of oblivion is there again. I keep like when I was thinking about it the other day, I kept wanting to call it the citadel. I don't know why. Now it's time to kill some birds. Hey birdie. Give me all EXP. Get some Perion drawings. Peyton, whatever it was. Kenny here. What is it? Captain, I'm sorry to report that it will take us longer than expected to reach your position. I knew it. That's not all. You see, our ultra-long-range sensors have detected a Chrono spacecraft. Readings indicate it is scheduled to arrive before us. That's pretty terrible news. We wish you the best, sir. What do we do? There's not much we can do. We're sitting ducks once that ship gets here. Our only hope is that this expunction technique works and they give up on Relia. Then let's hurry. It probably won't work. The devil child! If it will stand still! Just... I cannot even hit this thing! She's like, thank you! Somebody gave that double child a little too much sugar. Oh, here's some bees. Bees, bees, wonderful bees. That love the poison. Is poison a uh, buy time thing? So in most games, you don't really have to worry about poison. Ah, uh, that was... It is a mint stack here's point. Okay. Wait, I forgot. The full party menu. She's poisoned too? How did I not notice that? Oh, there's another devil child here. Oh, 
Come on, just take him out. Some common eggs. Am I going to get rare eggs eventually? Because it'd be weird if they were named common eggs and I didn't get rare eggs eventually. No, we just need to hurry up climbing this mountain to get to Santoro. Ah. More bees. More bees. That are gonna poison. Yep, I'm poisoned. Just the right way, right? Uh, it's one of the right ways. So, we learn now that their ship is gonna take forever to get here and finally come rescue us. So, their ship sucks. Save point down here. Heal point's not here anymore, but I'm gonna save. Their ship will come rescue us! After a chrono ship comes and takes Relia, see, this this is what's going to happen. That other ship's going to come here, and they're going to transport Relia away onto the ship. And then the other ship's going to come here, and we're going to have to chase them down on our ship to their ship in order to get Relia back. That's literally how the story's going to go, isn't it? I can see it now. Ah, let me love. Go away, Lon. Lansing Hotto. I don't care about you bees. See, I predict that because this whole story is just hinging on the fact that when we get where we need to go, Relia gets kidnapped. So I'm pretty much confident that we're going to get here and Relia is going to get kidnapped again. And then we're going to have to worry about it. No, child, get over here. Wait, what am I trying to... He's still poisoned? Where's her HP? Ah, her HP, fine. These are fairly weak enemies, too, so I'm not worried about it. Oh, Ridiculer, you're new. I'd only be worried if... I was poisoned during a boss fight. That's the only time I'd actually be worried. Sacred Plane Plus. And there's the entrance to the cathedral. I don't feel like I'm strong enough to take that on. So I'm going to ignore the cathedral. I'm going to hit you. Get a tomato and a nectar. Now it's just down the hill to Santa Roll. Like, this world, this game world doesn't feel very big. Be I mean, it feels big when you're having to backtrack throughout the whole thing. But, like, if you're doing it in bits and pieces, the world doesn't feel big. Like, you can get sand from Santoro to Medoc in just a couple minutes. You avoid most of the battles, or you spam your special skills and kill them all really fast. But it's just, it feels like padding. Like, they couldn't be bothered to add more areas to the world. Like, I mean, there was a spaceship. They couldn't add more worlds or more areas to the world. They mentioned other continents. It's like, they couldn't add that. It just really feels like padding because you're just running back and forth. Every, every time something happens, you're like, oh, we got to run all the way back across the continent. It's like, seriously? Just go where you need to go and stay there. Oh, they have bulletin board here. I forgot about that. Okay, that's just my ranting about the game. I mean, the game's not bad. It's just kind of... Some of the things it does are just... Whoops. Eh. Sweet on the outside. Vital importance after hours. Ooh, I can complete that one. I can get... Testament... To triumph out of it. Okay. Orcarina, Temptation, Light Gem. What do you get me? Swordsman Manual 1 and Golden Omelette. 
You give me an ice charm. Oh, I didn't realize how many of these are new. Sexy little devil. Okay, so steal yourself for the future. Signaturgical Book of Quietude. Get two love potions. Number four, six. Obtained Ocarina specialty. Oh yeah, what does that do? Where's it at? Oh, it's here. It takes two thousand. Gain the ability to attract monsters on the map by playing an ocarina. Oh, this is this is kind of a grinding skill, isn't it? Like, by the way, you can sit here and grind by calling monsters to you over and over again. Sorry. Uh, so what do you uh, sell me? Signet cards, Mercury. We have empty bottles, gunpowder, signet card. I have those. What are you gonna sell me? Sell me something good? Oop. Ah, run. Buy, buy some mints. I find a disturbing lack of, like, status ailments in this game. Like, I've seen poison, I've seen fog, I've seen paralyzed. But they don't bother me that much. Like, sure, they're there, but it's not like it causes any detrimental big things to me. Like, it's not like, oh, all of a sudden I'm going to die just because this status ailment is here. No, no, I have all these. Ooh, what is that I didn't have? Crest mail. The only Anne can wear. She's the only one who can wear it. Attack bracelet. Might as well buy everything I don't already have. Okay, there we go. Ooh, permit. Okay, so we're going to go... I just bought a bunch of new items. Let's see if there's any new foods I can make. Oh, there is a bunch. Flour. What I make? Pasta, pepper, on chino. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce that. Lemon tarts. What do you do? Defense plus three. Exp plus twenty percent for three battles. I'm guessing these are going to be a very big grindy thing. I'm out of wheat flour. I can't make that. This is more fun than I expected. Vanilla ice cream. Full plus twenty percent. Hot chocolate. Cover 20 MP and there's silence. Okay, I need to buy some. Which one of you is the right store? I'm looking for you. Give me your wheat. Give me your wheat. Where's it? That's it. Made a white beard or white bread. Yes, everyone made a white beard. Yeah, it's max MP plus 10% for free battle. So I'm guessing food can kind of be broken. What do I need? I need raw fish for you. I don't have raw fish. I need roe for you. And red fruit for you. I made so much food. I made almost all these foods. And like, you look over here at my potions. Usable item. Oh, there's another one. Uh, Yeah, sure, I'll use that. Physical stimulant. Why not? Back to Leah. Fill up reserve gauge once. What are you? Spring water, nectar, droppings, empty bottle. What are you? Cloudy cider. Still, lemon tart. Need more lemons to do that. I can buy more lemons. I don't know why I'm worried about that. But yeah, I guess that's a thing now. I can make lemon tarts 
and grind free XP using lemon hearts for three battles. Alongside the gold bunny that I got from day one. That should be pretty useful. And do like... So, I'm guessing the fastest way to grind out EXP in this game now is to have the gold bunny statue, to grind out your lemon tart, or to get lemon tarts, to fill the reserve gauge with EXP. I'm guessing that's what this is. We need to use the expunction device. What are you doing? Hold on a second. No time. Stop right there. You can't physically use it. What do you mean we can't? It's not functioning at the moment. We're still trying to determine the optimal way to fix it. <sighs> Why did it have to break now of all times? If you're in a hurry, might I suggest using the one in the Ancient Institute instead? There's one there? Of course. Most of the devices here are reproductions of ones in the Ancient Institute. <sighs> Thanks a bunch of Why don't you go look at the one you. there? Come on, we need to make for the Ancient Institute. We've got no other recourse, I guess. Let's book it. Again. Jeez. See, this is just padding the story. Like, it could have worked. You're like, we're determining the optimal way to fix it. Look at the one in the Ancient Institute to figure out how to fix it. Ah. Uh. So, north of Eastern I Heights, where I have to go. Uh, then is this way, so I'll just rest the inn. Yeah, I'll just rest the inn. You know, I don't need to sniff sniff. Sniff sniff. But yeah, that is the true essence of padding. Oh, sorry, the machine broke. You can't use it right now. Really? Oh, why don't you go use the one up in... That way, a couple miles. It's like, why can't we use this one? Because it's broken. <sighs> At least make your padding less blatant than that. Make it a little more interesting. Because <laughs> I do have to say, this game is fun. But the whole padding issue is just because they're not giving you anything to do it's just run here something happens run there something happens run there something happens now run all the way across the continent oh well we can't use it run up here they literally is just telling you to go everywhere this way Are you gonna trigger an event? Oh, you just say that's odd. I thought you were just kind of creepily standing there. I thought you were gonna trigger an event or something. Okay, let's run up to the institute. This is Kenny. I have an update, sir. The Chrono ship has just entered Fakery Force orbital trajectory. What? I hope we make it in time. Do you think you'll be all right, Captain? I'll contact you later. Yep. So there it is. As soon as we get to this tower, things are going to go down. And they're going to kidnap the girl again. And we're going to have to go rescue her again. Caterpillar fungus. Oh, nope. Takes three fresh sages, but I'll risk it. Okay, cutscene time, I guess. What's going on here? I guess we have no choice. I wouldn't. Who's that? General Alma. As part of Kronos' militant faction, he tops the galaxy's most wanted list. How kind for someone of his stature to greet us. So, he's behind all this. Fidel! 
Aurelia. But what? how can that be? Sis, what? Really? Uh, did she say sis? Are you too imbecilic to realize the instrument you have is not really a what? The one in your possession is Feria, and it is the foundation upon which Kronos is to build its new world order. It also differs from the unit you hold so much extraneous affection for. Thus, I doubt you will mind returning it. Why is a famous general fighting in the galactic equivalent of some backwoods Hicks family feud? Interesting question. I could ask the same of you, Captain Kenny. Hold oh. Just how do you expect to save Little Miss Starlight from all these heavily armored troops? If all the reports I have received on you are correct, well, I believe your name is Fidel. So, Fidel, if you possess even a modicum of sympathy for that thing, stand right there and don't move. Retrieve Farian for me. Nikki! I know that light. Activate the neutralization device. So, the boy is the catalyst after all. Fascinating. With some modifications, we should be able to draw even more power from her. Bring her here. We'll be taking Feria with us. Thank you for holding on to her, Fidel. Due to your act of kindness, we were able to collect precisely the data we needed. <laughs> <sighs> Take us away. Really? Damn it! I call this seem to have warped out. Now she's not even in the same sector as us. Isn't there something we can do to save Relia? Anything at all? We'd have to get our ship back before we could do anything else. And how long will it take for you to get it back? It's scheduled to arrive in a day at the earliest, but we'll likely arrive in two. Then all we can do is wait. Wait. This is a problem between the Federation and Kronos. There's no need for you Fakredians to get involved. It's too late for that. Don't take it the wrong way. She was thinking of your well-being when she said that. If you come with us, then... If we go with you? Then... You may never be able to return to this planet again. Even if we do save Lilia. We might never see our home again. Hmm. <sighs> If you wish to join us, be prepared for that eventuality. Those of you who remain undeterred can assemble in Santa Roll. Understood. Okay. You've already made up your mind, haven't you, Fiddly? Yeah. I'll always follow your lead wherever you take us. Maybe it'd be a good idea to return to Stahl first. I'll let you choose the way. I called it. I knew that was going to happen. Kenny here. Captain, our vessel will be arriving in Bakery 4 Sector in approximately 17 hours from now. Contact me again once you enter orbit. Do you think Fidel and the others will come? What would you do in my shoes? Would you be so eager to conduct research in an unknown land if it meant possibly throwing everything away and never coming home? <sighs> I bet you would. 
That's why you're not here now. If a true researcher somehow dropped a valuable piece of evidence into a bottomless pit, he'd jump right in after it without thinking a whit about his own safety. <laughs> right? What a poor excuse. I wonder if he believes it. As a central Rasulian officer, I have a responsibility to care for my subordinates and protect the country from harm. It would be wrong to forget that. On the other hand, what of Fidel? I can't in good conscience abandon my mentor's own son. Please, Master. I need your guidance. What would you do in my shoes? Fiddly, you do... ...recall when you guys... ...took me in, right? Yeah. So many were killed. Like Papa and Mama and more. Not to forget your own mom. Because that wicked illness... ...beset our little town. It was disastrous. I know I was certainly at wit's end. But then you said... These words. I'll take care of you like kin. Dry those tears, right? Stop that blushing here. <laughs> 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 was always another lance. Meaning my world lacked structure. I bet taking care of you is why... I'm still here today. You think so? <laughs> I shouldn't have said anything. <laughs> <laughs> we're no longer little kids now. No, we're not. Well, then, can we, uh, sorta, kinda. I don't want to stay your sister any longer. Well then, I'll stop being a big brother to you. Then can I call you Fidel now? Works for me. All right, Fidel. Here on out, I won't allow any people to hurt you. I should, I should say that, not you. Let's go. Our pals will want us back soon. <laughs> 